Uh, <laughs> hey guys. So, um, yes, if you haven't heard it before, um, this is my real voice. So, today, <clears throat> I am going to be answering your questions again. Because, um, uh, I, I didn't really know what to do for 4K, nor do I knew, nor do I know what to do for the up-and-coming 5K. Also, um, check my posts, I left a poll that you can vote on, and, um, yeah, that, that, that's what we're doing for 5K, a poll, so you can vote what we do. Alright, anyways, let's get into these questions, because there's, there, there's a good amount. So, we have a question from Alexandria and Dreo. I'm so sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. If you could do any job in the world without worrying about having the requirements for it, what would it be? Also, how old are you, by the way? Sorry if you have answered this before, I'm a new subscriber. Emojis. Well, first off, um, I don't know if I've answered this one before, maybe in the old Discord server, but, um... I don't really like to disclose my age, as I try to keep anything that could be used to identify me, like, away. Because even my age could be a dead giveaway. Well, with my voice, I, I don't really have to worry about that one. But, I will tell you this question. If I could do any job in the world, um, I don't know, honestly. I mean, thinking about it, probably therapist, you know, psychology. Like, if, if there weren't, if I didn't have to meet the requirements for it and I just had it instantly, definitely psychology. Because it's always been my dream to work with the human mind and try to help people and, you know, make people feel better. I mean, it's kind of why I do ASMR. It's my outlet for helping, you know? Because while I'm not, like, you know, studying, you know, neuro waves and all that other stuff, I'm still helping people and I'm still working with their minds. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, so we have a question from Chewy Leaf. If you were an animal, what animal would you be? Uh, probably a dog or a cat. I know, basic, but um, yeah, that, that's all that I really want to be. You know, well, if I could be a human too, like if I could be a variation, you know, like in those animes, definitely a cat boy. Like hell yes. Okay, so here we have a question from Anime Simp 101. What's your favorite ice cream flavor? Uh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I should not say no. Don't say no. Don't say no. Um, yes. Question from Meifu Sato? Sato? Nato? Um... Do you like jazz? And why do I love your voice so much? Well, while I can't answer your second question, I can answer your first question. Yeah. And then we have a question from Pero. Nice profile picture. Um, favorite albums? I don't really have any favorite albums, but I will say the favorite music artists I listen to. Um, Three Days Grace, I believe. I've listened to a little bit of Skillet. They're okay. And, um... Smash into pieces. Okay. Here we have a question, well, multiple from, Shizen. Do I play an instrument? Um, actively? No. But I used to play the trumpet, but I dropped out because I didn't find interest anymore. But I do have a piano that once I get some more s hardware... That's uh, for later, maybe after Christmas, you know, well, I should have it by then... Then I'll be able to make my own music for my videos that actually match the tone, and I and you won't have to deal with crappy ads anymore. Tea or coffee? Um, I'd have to go with coffee because it's just caffeinated and overall just gives me that boost I need in the day. How tall am I? Seven foot. No, I am about five six to seven. I don't remember the last time I checked, but last time I went to the doctors, they said I was 5'6". So, yeah, that's uh, nice. And a special question for... <clears throat> uh, um, c can we hold hands? Emoji. Well, I can tell you for 110%, sure. 
Really have to find me though. <laughs> okay, here we have a bunch of questions in a row, and I gotta read these on a very small screen. Let me see if I can make it bigger. Oh, there we go. That's better. Okay, so from Volatile Echo, they s they asked, "Do you plan on making a Discord server to interact with your subscribers?" Um, well, that depends on the poll. If the poll wins, definitely because that's what I'll be doing for the whole 5K. But at the same time. If I were to do it just, you know, not without a poll, eventually yes, but right now no, as um, I need, like, during Christmas break, I'm not doing anything, so I need to, like, know what my schedule is and, like, how stressful my life is going to be after Christmas break, so, um, it's, it's a possibility. Here we have a question from Sados Cult. What was your most regrettable purchase? Um, out of recent memory, the most regrettable thing that, like, I purchased, um, well, I didn't purchase it myself, I had a little help, but it was the Call of Duty Modern Warfare, the 2019 remaster, Battle Pass, because it's not even for Modern Warfare, it's for their new game, Cold War, which, before I start World War Three in the comments section, um, do I hate Cold War? No. I, I actually have never played it. Do I hate Modern Warfare? No. Do I hate COD in general? No. But what I think they're doing is completely scummy, and they should stop. They should let Modern Warfare live and not try to kill it. Okay. Next question from Kai... Adios. <laughs> Chalky milk or strawberry milk? I'm gonna have to go with chocolate milk. Sorry, but I don't like them strawberry seeds. Question from... Catalina Kudra. I'm so sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. Are you a fan of the singer Mufu Mufu? I'm asking since the drawing is of him. I also wanted to tell you I love your voice. Thank you very much for your videos. If I wrote something wrong, I'm sorry, I don't speak English. Um, no, your English is pretty on point. Um, the only thing that I spotted was um, when you asked the draw is of him, you should have said the drawing is of him. But, otherwise, that was good. Really good. Congratulations on learning English. It's really tough to learn. Um, and thank you. But, no. I actually don't listen to any of his music. I just like the image. I just like the images that I found. I didn't even know that that was of a singer. I think somebody in the comment section at one point told me it was of some singer. And when I looked it up, I couldn't really find anything. So, to whoever told me that, um, yeah, uh, I tried looking for them and I couldn't find anything, but no, I don't listen to them. Now we have a question from Frosty the Cat. Do you have a favorite book, if not a favorite movie? I don't, I don't know what to ask, I want to contribute. I don't know what to ask, but I want to contribute. Actually, do you like cats or dogs better? This is a very important question. Yes, it is a question of dire need to answer. And we'll get right back after this sponsorship. Right? No. No. No no sponsor. Um, favorite book? Probably Murder on the Moon, if you guys have ever heard of it. Um, it, it might not be called that. But basically, it's about, like, this, you know, dystopian future where, like, Earth is running out of resources. Like, it is actively dying because we couldn't manage the resources. So, we built a giant dome on the moon, and we sealed it so it could have oxygen. We have oxygen generators in it, and people live in it. It's not its not that comfortable, but it works. And, um, as you can tell from the title, somebody gets murdered. It's actually, um, spoilers, it's the person you spend a lot of time with. I'll give you that. Okay, so our next question... Questions, sorry, is from Night Mine Plays. Nice name. Do you plan on making a Discord server so your subscribers could interact and talk with you? Like I told the last person, same thing. Basically, you know, like, you, like I have to kind of see after Christmas break what my life is going to be like. But, you know, it's a possibility. And second, did you know that you and your videos are amazing? No, I am a terrible person, and my videos are crap. I'm just kidding, by the way, please. Whoever was that person who made, like, an entire paragraph, I love you. Thank you. And trust me, I, I know. I know my videos are okay. Don't worry. I'm not gonna knock my 
myself too hard down. Also, I wanted to say this, but thank you so much for your videos. I always feel so comfortable listening to them. Well, I'm glad, and I know from reading some comments that some people don't like my deep voice, but frankly, I like talking in it because it's a lot easier to talk in, and I don't have to, you know, up my voice and make it sound like this, because this actually takes a lot of energy to talk in. Okay, so next batch of questions is... From Harper, MHA fan. Oh, that's it. Okay. So we have questions from Harper. One, how would you react to a ghost haunting your house? Um, I think there's already a couple paranormal entities haunting the house. But overall, I'd probably just tell it to either buzz off or just ignore it. Unless it was, like, dangerous then I'd probably move or, well, I can't move, but I'd probably get someone to uh, exercise it. Should have drank some water before making this. <laughs> Would you rather fight a raccoon in a Wendy's parking lot with a coat hanger or 17 rats behind an Arby's? Um, I think a raccoon because, like, I can just run. But 17 rats behind an Arby's just sounds like hell. Like, they're already depressed, so they're gonna come try to eat me. And three, Aurora Borealis. At this time of year and at this time of day in this part of country, localized entirely within your kitchen? Um, uh, What? So, questions from MHA fan. One. Do you have a favorite anime or cartoon? My favorite anime overall probably has to be ReZero, but a close second would have to be Darling in the Franks. Now, those are the only animes that I've watched, besides Sword Art Online. <laughs> but, from those three and a bunch of random clips I've seen off, um, online of different animes, I have to say that ReZero is my favorite. I like the plot, I like the characters, and I like the whole idea of it. Their second question is, what's your favorite animal? I would say probably dogs, because they're just more more loyal on the spot. Now, I love cats, and my, like, current probably pet is a cat, which, um, her name is Ash. But, um, I would say I'm more of a dog person. Three, do you like chapter books or picture books? Well, I don't really read too much, but when I do read, I prefer chapter books because they're longer and more engaging. Four. Which would you rather have, us subscribers or anime more? I would rather have you guys alive than more anime. I, I mean, there's kind of like a, a wrong answer there. I mean, why would I want people to just die? Like, what? I'm getting reports that that is not what they're meaning. And that they're meaning that... Would I rather have more subscribers or more anime? And to be frank, uh, I, I, I don't know. I guess more subscribers? Uh, um, I don't really care. I mean, if people subscribe, yay! But if they don't, eh, that's alright. There's always more fish in the sea. Um, five. What's your favorite song? Is there a reason why you like the song? Um, well, technically my favorite song would have to be Get Out Alive by Three Days Grace. There is no reason behind me liking the song, I just like it. But my favorite song would probably be, um, like, with a reason, The Chosen One by Smash Into Pieces. Because it kind of speaks to me on, like, a personal level, kind of like fighting through everything and, you know, faking Faking it until you make it, you know, all like all that deal. Like, I kind I kind of feel that because in my early childhood, like I had to push through a lot of uh, pain and trauma with uh, some certain people. That that's not a story for a celebration. That that's a story for another time. Here we have some questions from Arletti. One, do you have any social media, or are you thinking? To create some way we can contact you. Well, technically, you can already contact me via business email, but I probably won't respond because I don't check that at all. But, 
Um, no, I don't have any social media, and I would really prefer not to create a Twitter, because Twitter is very toxic. But, like I said, with the whole Discord thing, it's possible. Too. How are, how am I these days? Um, on average, I'm okay. Mental health is, uh, a steady, like, line. Not up, not down, just steady, but usually it, it tends to try to go down. I have to somehow lift it up either by eating, drinking, or reading y'all's comments because y'all are fucking cute. Three, what types of music do I listen to? Oh, good. Um, rock? Heavy rock. Depression. <laughs> <clears throat> Hold on. Those, you know, rock, heavy rock, probably some metal, electronic music, calming music, and um, I listen to a lot, okay? I don't really have a specific genre I stick in, but usually my tastes are for metal, rock, and um, electric. Four. Do I have any pets? If yes, can you show us? Um, love you too platonically. I can't really show you guys, because it's... I can't really just make a post with my phone for some reason. It, it won't let me. I don't know why. But, um... I do have pets. <sighs> um, I don't know if you can hear the one meowing in heat in the background, but yes, I have a lot of pets. A lot of cats. And, um, I can't show you, but I can describe most of them. Most of them are just cats. They They range from colors. But the one that I claim is mine is Ash. She is, of course, you know, ash-colored, like, gray, white, and silver, all those colors. And she's the, um, only remaining survivor of her sister. Well, she was the only two out of anything, and her sister was killed by a dog that was next to her with some food. So, you know, that was, uh, fun. But, yeah, that happened. It's done, it's said and done now. Can't really do anything about it. That's just how the cookie crumbles. Okay, so we have some questions from Lil Small Cat. <sighs> One, what made you start this channel? Um, okay, well, if I'm going to be technical, back long ago in, like, the 2019s, I was looking at ASMR, and, you know, I was listening to it, and I liked it. And I was looking at how it helped people... And how, like, you know, it was actually pretty popular. It wasn't something that was unheard of. So I thought, well, if I make ASMR, not only am I going to be doing something that helps, it's not going to just get, you know, unnoticed by YouTube's algorithms. It's actually going to be seen, and I won't be wasting my time trying to, you know, make content for people, and they don't see it. And... I did not expect the traction that my channel has gotten. I did not expect to already be close to 5k. We're not even a year in. And this would be, like, like, and it's such a long time coming for some channels that I've seen. There are so many channels out there, and it still baffles me how I was chosen by the YouTube algorithm in this way. And how you guys, you, all of you, all 4.9k of you, soon 5k of you, chose me. And there's a lot more of you that aren't subscribed yet. And I see you. I see you. I see you watching there. I see you. I'm Santa Claus. <laughs> Anyways. But overall... That's the technical reason behind me starting this channel, but I never uploaded. So, eventually, I met this person on Discord, and um, there, there's a lot of stuff, a lot of backstory behind it, but basically, um, got together with them, we made this channel, they made the art, I did the voicing and the editing, um, they did the scripts, and, you know, blah 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 blah, stuff happens, you know, and now I'm the owner of the channel, and I, and I do everything now. It's a, it's a long story, and there's a video about it. I think it's, like, update and why I left, or, like, update, I'm back, something like that. Anyways. <clears throat> they, they're they the one who came up with, like, the idea of doing it. They kind of sparked my key for ignition, I guess. 
No. <laughs> I have a better term for it. They they were the key to the car. I had built the car, but I didn't have the key. They had the key, but not the car. Combining our forces together, we got the car going. But eventually, things happened, and now I'm the one who has the car and the key. There we go. That's better. Two. Why is your voice so amazing? I don't know. Um... Uh, I'm told that, like, my voice is nice sometimes, but usually out in public, I don't speak, or, um, I'm overshadowed, so I, I couldn't tell you, honestly. Three, this is unrelated, so you don't need to answer if you don't want to. Do I like your PFP? Yes, it is adorable. It looks like a doe cat is having its face lightly tugged on. Alright, that's all the questions. So, I also did want to, like, talk a little bit about me and a couple other questions that I've had that I would ask myself. So, like, a question that I'm surprised I haven't seen is, where is Winged? I'm legitimately surprised that nobody wonders where they're at, why they're not in the description, and why um, they're not there, and why the server isn't there anymore. Um, to put it to you guys simply, things happened between us, and eventually I took the channel because none of us were up, like, nor, yeah, me and them weren't uploading anything, and I wanted to upload, but I didn't know if they wanted to, so I ended up going ahead and just taking the channel, because when I offered, you know, to let them have the channel, they said they wouldn't do it unless I was here. So, using my, um, critical thinking skills, which every human should have, they're mind-blowing, I figured that, you know what, I will go ahead and go make some content. And that's where we're at now. I just said, fuck it. I'm taking the keys and I'm going. And if you want more details, I can explain in the comment section if you ask. But, um, that's the simple thing behind it. Another thing that I would ask myself... I'm, I'm chewing some gum for you guys, by the way. Just give me a sec. Another thing I would ask for myself is, um... There you go. ASMR. <clears throat> Another thing I would ask for myself is, like... What are some of your heroes or, like, ASMR, you know like, heroes. If I go to my subscription list, you don't see many. You see Ear Licking Channel, which they have uh, some pretty nice thumbnails. Fallen Shadow ASMR, Lemon Leaf ASMR, One of My Friends, and Polecat. Overall, um, well, Fallen Shadow is definitely one of my bigger inspirations. I gotta say, guys, there's this um, ASMRist out there. Um, he's, I believe, German, and he is so good at what he does. His name is Zeitgeist, and he is great at what he does. He's, he's been my inspiration for the longest of times. Hmm. Well... That's the end of that. If you guys have any more questions, leave them in the comment section, and I will try to get to them. Um, just a little bit more recording time. Fuck it. This gum tastes really weird. <sighs> Alright, guys. Um, I, I don't know how to end this off. I guess that'll be all for now. Um, I'm trying to get this out before we hit 5k. 
So, if there's some things that aren't cut out, I am very sorry. But I'm, I gotta get this out before we hit 5k or else, like, I will explode. So, yeah. I will see you guys later. Um, you are all equally awesome, cute, and loved. And make sure to eat healthy, get some sleep, because if you're watching this when it's posted... You should go back to sleep. And I'm gonna go catch some Z's. Later, y'all. Bye-bye.